Corporate Accountability and Public Participation Africa Kappa and Nigeria Tobacco Control Alliance NTCA have raised the alarm that the National Tobacco Smoking Act 2015 law does not exist, which raises concerns about the legislative intent and procedural soundness. The House of Representatives Committee on Healthcare Services had on Friday held a public hearing to discuss two proposed bills aimed at amending the National NTCA 2015, titled House Bill HB 47 and HB 1151. The proposed bill titled HB 47, sponsored by Pascal Agudike, seeks to address gaps in the principal act, enhance its implementation, and close loopholes that the tobacco industry continues to exploit. HB 1151 seeks to impose stiffer penalties for violations of smoking regulations. Executive Director of CAPA, Akimbo de Oluwafemi, said that any proposed amendments to the current tobacco control law must genuinely seek to strengthen and not weaken it. Our hopes of young Nigerians to be initiated. And most importantly, that they shouldn't be initiated into consuming what is now imagined products. And why we are saying that we be done. Details of that will be uh, explained later. We are deliberately saying that the Act is National Tobacco Control Act, and that any attempt to infuse, inject the word smoking into the title of the Act will uh, undermine its objective. Because it is not just about smoking, it's about tobacco use. Thousands of measures are said are consuming some of these products that even the industry is promoting as safer options. Sometimes they say they are less products. There are a lot of scientific evidence to show that it, that is not true. And we recommend that the amendment should cover some of these products. They should be regulated like tobacco products. We must regulate how our use are taken to the continental institution. We continue to hear argument from the industry proponents advocating the so called right to smoke and the road rights to safer alternatives. Smoking along with the value of the views and the product is just not a personal choice. Senior Program Manager Kappa Zikora Ibe re-echoed the need to regulate digital marketing of tobacco and emerging products. To be clear, we are saying that the Federal Ministry of Health and Social Welfare, through the Tobacco Control Unit and the National Tobacco Control Committee, be strengthened by equipping them with the resources, tools, and capacity needed to perform their duties diligently. These units serve as the brain power and operational engine room of the National Tobacco Control Act. And retaining them as the primary oversight body of tobacco control in Nigeria ensures that policies and initiatives are grounded in evidence-based public health principles, rather than being influenced by non-health sectors that may lack the requisite focus or technical expertise. Other stakeholders also called for the elimination of the designated smoking area DSA, saying that it did not work as people smoke anywhere they like in the country.